summertime is bursting with fresh berries and zucchini. So let's make a recipe today that celebrates these healthy foods and flavors. Stay tuned. Hi, my name is Katrina. Welcome to the Organics channel, where we love getting together in the kitchen every week and creating healthy and delicious recipes to keep you inspired all year long. Today, we're going to be making a collagen-rich raspberry zucchini smoothie. Let's begin by adding one half of a cup of either fresh or frozen raspberries to your high-speed blender. Raspberries are rich in antioxidants, and all that means is they help protect your cells from free radicals that can cause dis-ease in the body. Next, I have one half of a cup of grated zucchini. You want to be sure to leave the peel on because that's where you're going to find most of the antioxidants. One quarter of a cup of gluten-free oats. So I know that some of you do not eat oats. So all you can do is just omit this and then increase the amount of raspberries and or zucchini. For a little bit of protein and healthy fat, I have two tablespoons of almond butter. Both protein and healthy fat are going to help you feel full longer. It's also going to help slow down the absorption of sugar, which helps regulate blood sugar levels. Our sweetener today is going to be one large pitted date. I have one tablespoon of ground flaxseed. I've been adding this to my morning drink lately because it helps to regulate how estrogen is metabolized in the body by either increasing or decreasing the amount needed. The juice of one lemon, which is about three tablespoons, this next ingredient is optional. I'm going to add in two scoops of our clean sourced collagens powder for an extra boost in digestion, joint, hair, skin, teeth, nails, and bone health. Did I get everything? It's so good. I just love adding this to my recipes. I do it all the time. One cup of your preferred unsweetened milk and you certainly can substitute this with some filtered water instead. Blend up all of your ingredients really well. Depending on how thick you like your smoothies and whether you used frozen or fresh raspberries, you may want to add in some ice. Some additional garnishing ideas are a little bit of cinnamon and maybe even a little bit of lemon zest. Okay, let's give this smoothie a taste. That is a wonderful blend of flavors. It is not super sweet, which I love, and I can taste the lemon and the raspberries, and the oats in there gives it this feel like it's a muffin almost. It's really delicious. I highly recommend when you're drinking it to just take your time, especially if you're going to use this as a meal replacement. Give your body enough time to then really realize when it's getting full and satisfied. If you drink it down so fast, your body's gonna be like, okay, where's the rest? So just take your time, enjoy it. I hope you give this one a try. Thanks so much for joining me today. Hey, we appreciate you being here. Take great care of yourself, and I look forward to seeing you next week in the kitchen. Bye-bye.